Hello friends. In the previous session, we learned learned about normalization and its anomalies. In this session, we'll start with the normalization process. As we all know that there are uh, many forms of normalization, basically from one NF to uh, moving on to five NF, and there's also a special form which is called as BCNF. So we'll be looking at each one by one, and uh, we should know that if uh, that this basically follows a hierarchy that if we have to see that whether a particular table or a relational schema is in 2NF, we first need to check about the 1NF or the lower normalization forms, right? So, uh, we'll start with 1NF in this session and we'll move on to various normalization forms in the following session. Let's start with 1NF. Now, a relational schema R is said to be in 1NF if it does not contain any multi-valued attributes. So, this is the basic rule behind uh, checking whether a table or a relational schema is in 1NF or not. See, we've been given with an example in this case. Uh, this is an example of the students and the various sports played by them. Uh, it says that Ritu plays badminton, Ajay plays chess and Ludo, Sonia plays Ludo chess, Diggy plays cricket hockey, etc. So, uh, as you can see, uh, there are comma separated values present in this table, but we never store a relational schema in this form. So simply as this attribute is a multi-valued one, this form is not in 1NF. So this table is not in one uh, normal form and in order to convert it into a normalized form into the first NNF form into the first normal form, what we do is we simply write it like this. That is if there are multiple values across various tuples, like for example, Ajay had two sports being played as chess and Ludo, we would write them as separate rows like this. So, Ritu plays badminton, Ajay plays chess, Ajay plays Ludo as well. Sonia plays Ludo, Sonia plays chess, Diggy plays cricket, Diggy plays hockey. So, this is how we convert a table into a first normal form. So, this table, now finally this new table does not contain any multi-valued attribute. There are only single values or atomic values in this, in both the attributes over here. Hence, this is in one normal form, this is in first normal form. So, this was the procedure to convert a table into first normal form. In the following video, in the next video, we will be covering 2NF and so on. Thank you for... Uh, viewing this video and if you liked it please like it please keep following the channel for upcoming videos thank you